kind of an ASEAN, you know, culinary body. And I'm going to go one step here. Why ASEAN? Why not world? You know, there's a lot of heritage, street food culture in parts of the world that hasn't even been born or seen or uh, realized yet. So, 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 yeah. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick on you guys now. Um, we picked out, I don't know, maybe ten or so ideas, uh, and uh, we're gonna bring you up here on stage. Three minutes. Tell us what's it all about. Who's the first one? Okay, this like it should be up here. Can you follow here? No, no, no. We have already picked up. Yeah. Okay. Can we show the pictures? All right. Okay. The chosen ones are. Hang on. And the first one is. If you haven't tried Papita's uh, lechon, stuff, man, you haven't lived, man. Because after you eat, you'll die. Okay, some of the best street food of the Philippines are found far from Manila. Uh, why don't TV create and market food where so the world food lovers can enjoy the Timothy Thai. is a uh, food blogger from uh, Penang, one of the greatest food destinations in Southeast Asia. And uh, yeah, it, it's a uh, uh, Timothy. Why don't you come and tell us why? Why, why are you saying this? And as a uh, well, somebody's got an answer already, and she's gonna come up and tell you uh, later in a while. Timothy, hi everybody. What's your vlog's name? Penang travel tips. Penang travel tips. What's it all about? Why do you suddenly write this? Well, I'm curious about things. I love to eat. I love to see places. I can see that. <laughs> I was very slim once. Okay. <laughs> we were all very slim once. <laughs> and last month I had the great opportunity of joining Sito and Chef Sao to explore the food of the Philippines and I had such a wonderful time. But it was, a, it was a 15 hour food frenzy tour designed as a prelude to publicity for the World Street Food Congress. So the possibilities of doing a uh, curated food culinary experience is already there. Tell us what you think about it. What was it all about? It was an experience of seeing the street food as well as the home cooked food of the Philippines in places which myself, if I were to visit the Philippines, I would limit myself to Manila because my knowledge of Philippine food culture is limited to Manila. However, there's so much to discover of the food of the Philippines and I'm so grateful that I had the privilege of seeing this and to go to all those places including to 25 states in Panama. Where is that? What, which restaurant is that? Uh, it's a restaurant by a very very humble and very handsome chef. Okay. <laughs> no, I wanted to ask you know, um, you know, you discovered some things at the, at the trip, right? You know, despite all the efforts by folks like Ancon, so many bloggers and writers around the world, why is Philippine food still so unknown? So unknown. Yeah. Anyone want to answer that? Can you help me with that? Yeah, ask, ask anybody outside of this and they let's, can go beyond Let's, let's be interactive. Lechon, um, adobo, not even let's, CC. Let's you know? ask... Uh, Anyone who wants to answer that? Tita Idir? Hello. Uh, yes, good afternoon. I'm Clan Garcia. Hi. I'm a tour operator. I run culinary tour, so just to answer your queries. And uh, in case you have a kit, they're giving away food holidays. So this is what I put together. Um, it's itinerary day, so it's categorized in culinary day tours 